one. Um, if you're in my sort of age bracket, you might be finding yourself in uh, self-isolation, as I am at the moment. I think I'm okay, but I've got a bit of a cold. Hopefully that's all it is, not the virus, but we'll see. Um, but I'm finding myself some more time on my hands at the moment. So I thought I would show you a little example of something you can do within um, Audacity. Uh, there's a helpful feature. At the moment, I'm trying to learn to play Runaway by Del Shannon, which is a wonderful piece. Um, but in fact, it's the middle section is, is rather difficult to master. Um, the bit I'm talking about, I think, I think it starts about here. <laughs> And it is a lovely bit of music in that, that centre part, but it's it's got me beaten at the moment. So what, what you can do with Audacity, Audacity is you can highlight the section that you want to, to learn, which is probably about that much, I think, in here. And I can effectively slow it down by changing the tempo, not changing the speed. If you change the speed, then the pitch will shift, so everything goes out of kilter with your guitar. Um, but by doing a changing tempo, I can slow this down, and it, you see I've done this before, about 20% slower. And that stretches the music out, but it keeps the pitch the same. If I play that. So I can now change how slow I want it to be in order for me to start learning what the notes actually are and try to put them together. Um, now I won't actually show you me attempting this because it could take a long while, but I just thought I'd let you see this <coughs> um, as I find it a very useful feature. I hope you do too. Thanks for watching.